He's so sweet. This is what he does while I'm um, getting ready for the day. So this is going to be the start of today's vlog. Um, I'm going to vlog again today because I have lots to do. Um, I have to go grocery shopping, but first we're taking him to the park. Um, I'm probably going to take him out in a minute too because he hasn't gone out yet this morning. So Normally in the morning he's just kind of leaving around, so I take my shower and put on my makeup and then after that I can take him to the park um, or outside and then yeah to the park so all that jazz so I'm just got done putting on my makeup it looks horrible no I'm not a beauty glue guru definitely not so <laughs> that's that um it's actually really dark today I might wipe some of it off um but anyway so yeah so gonna take him to the park today look at the smile he's so happy He's smiling. Good boy. I always have him open it in the morning. <laughs> Even though I don't necessarily need it. It's just good practice with it. Since she's here, he does this. And this is how we are training him not to bark. Come here. He only does this when he knows it's her. And he knows it's her. Cause it's her. <laughs> Quiet. Stay. I put him all the way over there. And I answer the door. Stay. This is what we're working on. Currently. At home. Stay. She's so excited, then it's her. Stay. 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 So hard. Stay. This is really hard for him. He's gonna really good though. Okay, dismissed! Oh, I don't know if he dismissed himself as I dismissed him or what, but... <laughs> Water. Come on! Nah, -uh. don't jump in it, please. Come on! You can do it. Cross it, yeah. Who's a hiking dog? Ooh. Got him wearing boots. Don't think it matters because these have so many holes in it, and not from patches. The rumors thought it was patches. Here we go. Go on your hike. Let's go. He loves this. He loves being independent for such a dog who doesn't like to play by himself sure loves to be independent <laughs> he's able to run into my mom's house off leash now too and stuff he just people are there okay. gotta see what kind of dog is it up oh, or not patches patches come here come here good come Park. um he did good he got to play with two other dogs <laughs> um yeah they were friendly, so that was fun for him. I, that's why I didn't film. I don't really feel comfortable filming other people's dogs, just like I wouldn't film someone's child. So, so I didn't film him playing with them, but he had fun. <laughs> Except one dog, all he wanted to do was play with his ball, and the other dog um, would play with Patches, but that dog left early. And so Patches grabbed the other dog's ball because he's like, chase me, chase me. And the other guy like didn't want Patches to play with it, even though his dog wasn't like aggressive with it or anything. So I don't know why. I encourage other dogs to pet lay with patches as things so he doesn't form like resource aggression or aggression of like that's mine you can't have it so i let other dogs all the time play with his toys just so that way he learns it's okay it doesn't matter and patches honestly doesn't even care if there's a dog around he just wants to play with it he doesn't care what they're playing with or doing so i don't know why it was a big this issue but it was so but we got it back and get back to him but now we're going shopping so that's good. He's thirsty boy. He's a thirsty boy. Very good shopping. Yeah. Good boy. He's a handsome. Taking a nice nap before we go to do our big shopping trip. He needs it after all that park running he got to do today. All that socializing. Are you ready to go work? Do you want to go to this? Oh go, yeah. As we are at the store, as soon as we pulled in, he sits up. <laughs> are you ready to go work? Do you want to go in the store? <laughs> Who says service dogs don't like working? I think they love it. <gasps> I think they do. He is a little thirsty, so he might be panting a little bit because he just got down with the park and I don't have water on me. So, but he'll be fine. He'll survive. I'll be a fall. We'll get to tomorrow when we go home. I love their service dog sign. It has, well, I mean, it's cute. But it has the ADA law on it, which, you know, most don't. So, I love one coast service dog signs. Because they actually have 
fit a whole lot on it. So that's good. Watch me. Thank you. Good watch me. Oh, we have to run out to the car and get them. <laughs> Maybe you could just run out really quick so I don't have to bring back through the parking lot. Where do you want it? Let's see what I'm looking for. Come. Let's see what's in. Boy, you're doing a good job. This is very good. Watch me. Where is it? Where's the chair? Go find it. Where is it? Go find me the chair. Find me the chair. He's it, I think. Find me the chair. Good boy. Yes. I step on it and get very, very anxious. Sit. I mean, <laughs> chin. Thank you. Oops, he's all tingled. That's... There he does. Yeah. Good boy. Okay, now chin. Good boy. Chin. Okay, you can do that. Like, I don't care what shape you do. I was going to sit down on the ground and do full DVT, which I kind of need, but it's kind of hard to do because sometimes you just can't find a spot to do it in. But they have this chair, so we're going to do half DBT, which I guess will be fine for now. This is a good boy. I'm going to go. Oh, is a sweet boy. Good watch, me. Wait, closer. Good job. Good boy. Good watch me. My lungs are a little sore. Um, stop. Good job. Let's go this way. Ah, uh, this way. This is the aisle I wanted. Okay, so we're down in the store. He did really good as always, although he was a little distracted today, but he did pretty darn good. He's always so good when I bag up the groceries and when I put them on the thing, he just sits and watches. Patches, watch me. Thank you. I think he smells the string cheese in there. <laughs> this is what he's wanting. Did you get cheese? Because after I put that in the cart, it was all over. <laughs> he paid attention. He just like kept looking over at the cart and then looking back at me. I think he knows I got him his cheese. But anyway, so we're going to go to, um, is this zoomed in? I feel like it is. No, it's not. Okay, but. Anyway, we're gonna go to Safeway because I need to get some meat. So it's meat time. And then I need to go to Costco, but I'll probably go tomorrow because it's quite worn out and Safeway's on the way home, so might as well stop by it since I'm going home anyway. Let's go and get some meat. And then I should be off for today, huh, beautiful? Here's a good boy. Did you have fun? High five. Yeah, good boy. Did you have fun? It's like I always have fun in the store, mama. I always have so much fun. Watch me. Good boy. Oh, the store is packed too. It must be holidays, so it's... Good boy. Watch me. Thank you. Christmas. Watch me. Watch it! Watch me! Thank you! Oh, we're going this way. <laughs> okay, come! Oh, no, I did buy it cheaper. Yay! I saw seven up. It's two bucks here. I bought it for a dollar, like, forty or something at, at Winco. So I normally go out. I like to see my savings. Watch me, Patches. Thank you. Okay, we focus them a minute. I don't know. Watch me. Patches. Thank you. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I'm getting pushed into this stuff. Patches, watch me. 
Thank you. Oh, now we're stopping here. Watch me. Goodbye. We're in the meat department. We're going for some steak now. I got some chicken. You know, we need the steak. I'm going to give him a treat because I don't be treating him. Good boy. Yeah. He has a treat for a job. Well done, huh? My lungs starting hurting, so give him a little bit. Kelly says 10. How do I do it? Treat my medicine at night because that way when I take my meds, yes, good boy. Oh, get it, he dropped it. Um, that way, good boy. Thank you. There you go. Um, good practice. I need to take medicine anyway, so it's one of those things. It's like we might as well practice and have to because I need the bag anyway. So, and he likes it, it's his favorite task. Yes, that's so fun. That seriously has been his favorite task since I taught him it. it how old was he, like 10 months, 1, something like that? High five. High five. Yeah, good boy. He was going to touch it. Touch it. Touch, touch it. Touch it. Touch it. Yeah, good boy. <laughs> he's so funny. I think he thought he was. Touch it. Touch it. <laughs> Thank you, good boy. He's like, I'll high five you. <laughs> good boy. Good boy, Scoop, so it's hard work today. Dismissed. Good boy. So that's today's vlog because I'm just gonna put away my groceries. We literally just got home. I think I have my shoes yet, even. Um, but yeah, so he did really good today. It's been a bad anxiety day, and I don't know why. <laughs> Some days are just like that, and today was definitely one of them. Um, at Safeway, I had him. I think I had a clip from Safeway. I had him do deep pressure therapy, and then <laughs> people do pretty good not talking to him. I mean, generally speaking. Of course, they always say, you know, cute doggy and all that stuff, but generally, I feel like they do pretty good. Like, it's not really a daily issue we deal with, thank goodness. Like, I know some handlers. But whenever he's tasking is when people decide, oh, he's so cute. Oh, he's being so good. So, whenever he's alerting or tasking, that's when people do it. And when I was having him do, when I had him do deep pressure therapy, because I had him do full on, because I was just, like, really stressed today. I don't know why. Um... But I had him do full on deep pressure therapy because I was just, ooh, it was just all the people and I was just, yeah. Um, so I sat on the ground, which I actually wasn't going to have him do full on deep pressure therapy. I bent down to pet him because I knew I was getting a little stressed. And I fell down and he came on my lap and did it himself because I think he was feeding off that I needed it. <laughs> um, but some woman came over and studied, you know, of course, cute doggy, cute doggy. My friend's like, because when I need it like that bad, I literally can't speak. I just can't. And so I didn't say anything. I was just watching him and petting him and paying attention to him. Which, he did good. He wagged his tail, but as soon as I said leave it, he stopped. So he does really good with it. But but um, but um, my friend's like, you know, he's tasking right now. He's working. And she just kept going on, kept going on, wouldn't stop. Um, and, you know, of course I was just ignoring her. I just kept looking down at my dog. Because I find sometimes ignoring them helps best. Plus I was not going to speak to anyone at that time. <laughs> Um, if you're getting a drink, he's been out all day. <laughs> so, it's really annoying when the public does things like that. And it seems like whenever he does, especially deep pressure therapy when he's laying on my lap, is when people think he's adorable. Which is annoying, because that's one of the times I need him the most, you know, then alerting and, alerting and all that stuff. So, yeah, but I don't know why it was such a bad anxiety day. I think it was just one of those things. Um, we started out strong, but I think it's just because I felt like there was a lot of people in the stories today. And so anyway, so come here, Patches. Come finish the outro. Come finish it. Yeah, he's so cute. Come here. But he did He did really good today. Um, he's ready to be home and play. Um, he did really good today. It's just, it was just me. Um, just bad anxiety day. So I had him do deep pressure at Winco, and then again at Safeway I had him do full on deep pressure because I think I really needed full on at Winco, but sometimes it's just hard to find a spot to do it. <laughs> do you go to the park again? Park? 
<laughs> I think that's a yes. Um, I don't think we're going to go to the park again, though. Mama, it's pretty tired. Her lungs hurt. She's tired. So, anyway, so it was, I think it was just one of those days, so. Um, but anyway, other than that, it's been a pretty good day. We finished all of our shopping except for the stuff I have to get at Costco, so. That's today's vlog. I don't know how long it's going to be and how much fun footage I have. It was a really, like, anxiety day, so I don't know that I filmed a whole bunch. I don't always film him tasking because when I need him to task, I'm not filming it unless I'm training it and don't actually need it. <laughs> um, so I didn't film him doing full-on deep pressure therapy, um, or... I did film it at Winco because it was just kind of convenient. I was like, oh, I'll film him finding the chair, and then it was just kind of convenient that I already had my phone out. But normally I don't think to do stuff like that. And by the time I got sick, I was just bad anxiety. Don't know why. Don't know where it came from. Sometimes days are just bad anxiety days. So today was one of those days, definitely. Um, yeah, I don't know why. I feel like I slept good last night. But I think maybe it's because my lungs are kind of sore because the weather's been changing again. And so after the park, my lungs were kind of sore. And when they get sore, then my anxiety gets really bad. And it just spirals out of control. But... We had fun, huh? High five. Yeah, goodbye. He says, goodbye. Did you have fun working? That's a cute picture. I see that when I'm filming. I'm like, oh, that's so cute. Um, anyway, so, look how he's sitting. He's sitting like a little guy. Um, but yeah, so that's today's vlog. Um, he did really good today. He really did. Um, I know when I get nervous or when my lungs start hurting, I start thinking he's doing everything awful even when he's not. <laughs> so, I mean, I feel like he had a little bit of an off day because... He kept trying to herd my friend and I together. Um, so I feel like he did have a little bit of an off day where he lose focus. Well, not even really lose focus. I just feel like he was just kind of not on his A game. But then again, I think it's just because sometimes when I get nervous, I start thinking he's being awful when he's being really fantastic. And he really was being fantastic. Especially for me being so nervous because, I mean, he was calm. He was tasking. He was alerting. Um, he was doing everything he was supposed to um, do. Even when Mama got frustrated with him, because sometimes anxiety just makes you frustrated with people and animals that you love, even when you don't mean to be. Huh. But he did really good. He got big treats. That's it. And I think I didn't treat him as much today either, because I was so nervous. And when I get really nervous, I don't treat as much, which, I mean, it's good, because I am winging him off of treats, so he doesn't have to be treated constantly. Um, so he doesn't eat as much as he used to anyways, but, um, but yeah, it was just Overall, bad anxiety day to do, but I got my shopping done. Um, definitely couldn't have done it without him tasking, so I'm really thankful to have him. Um, sometimes, too, what causes it, and like, obviously lots of things cause it, so this isn't the main reason, but, um, but sometimes it's just hard to maneuver a 60-pound dog through a store, and even though, yes, it's worth it, and yes, I couldn't do it without him, just sometimes it's hard. Like, I don't understand people that say, you know, oh, I, want, I wish I could bring my dog everywhere, because sometimes... It's really hard. I mean, like today, there's a lot of people there. There's big lines. There's people all over the aisles. So to maneuver a 60-pound dog is kind of hard. Um, it's worth it because I couldn't do it without him. I literally could not have done today without him. So it's definitely worth it, but it's hard. <laughs> I mean, sometimes it's just hard to maneuver a 60-pound dog through aisleways. Um, and you, so... I mean, it's worth it again, but it's just hard sometimes. So I don't understand pe people who say, I wish my dog could do that or go everywhere with me. Because sometimes it really is not fun. <laughs> I mean, of course, there's those days where it's fun and it's kind of like, you know, like I know handlers have gone to Disneyland and I'm excited to go to Disneyland so I can take pictures of him and things like that. So, of course, there's there's fun days where you're just really excited to have a service dog and do it with them. But then there's today's like today where it's like, I couldn't have done it without him, but it was hard to do it with him. So, totally worth it. When it changed this guy for anything. But that doesn't mean it's always easy. So, and it, it was just a bad anxiety day. So, but he did wonderful. He tasked. When I fell down, I wasn't even to have him do deep pressure. Because sometimes it's hard to find, like, a corner to do it in. So, you're not in people's way. And so, that adds to my anxiety finding, you know, even when I know I need it. It's just, like... I need to find a place to do it in, and it's hard because you don't want to be in anyone's way or get nasty looks for being in people's way, <laughs> um, and so, but I fell down at, like, the perfect spot that was out of the way, oh, my phone's only at 5%, um, but I felt, because I fell down to pet him because I knew I was getting nervous, but I randomly fell down, Patches, watch me, <laughs> this is cheese, um, I do have to put my groceries away, so, 
So yeah, so I randomly fell down and he came over and did it himself. So I think he kind of knew, I think he knew I needed it. Um, and I think he was alerting to it, which is part of why he was a little distracted. was because he's like, Mom, you need me right now, you need me. He just knows when it's like real and when it's not. Like if I, he alerts and it's real, <laughs> he's looking for his cheese. I'll get you a bite of cheese, okay? Um, <laughs> yeah, I know what you're looking for. You might think I got bones too, which I didn't because he's not allowed to eat bones anymore. Um, but yeah, so I think that's part of why he was distracted is because when I have a really off day, then he does, and I know it's because he's feeding off of me, and he's trying to alert to me, and I'm not listening because I'm, like, so stressed in the moment, so, but once we did it, we did it, and once he did fall on deep pressure therapy, I calmed down. Now I feel much better. Now I just have to put my groceries away. So anyway, that's going to be today's vlog. My phone's done. My dog wants cheese, and that's going to be it. So... As always, please like, comment, subscribe, do all things, and we'll see you later. Bye, guys.